Hi and welcome to brand new product review by DreamReef.nl. Today we're taking a look at the Reef Dozer Evo 4. This brand new dosing pump by Aquamedic has not even been released yet and we already got the opportunity to take a look at it. It's due to be released somewhere near the end of March 2015. Now what separates this dosing pump from the bunch is that it comes with an external controller which just makes it very easy to control and you won't have to crawl all the way into your sump area to adjust a few settings of your dosing pump. On top of that it will also come with all the required lining for your dosing pump. Another neat feature is that there will be an extension module that you can just hook up and that way you will have 8 instead of 4 dosing pumps to control. Now there's also a couple of neat features in the programming itself. For example you can set it to dose every four or more days instead of just a few times a day. So enough talking, let's go and take a look at this dosing pump. First thing we have to do is hook up the controller on the right side of this pump housing. It's very easy, you just pick up the plug which is a standard network plug and you put it in the side port we just viewed and that's it. Then the next thing you need to do in order to use this pump is hook up the power. The power supply is in the back and you can also see the port for the extra controller if you wish to hook that up. So that's very easy, just pick up the power plug, put it in the back and basically you're ready to go. Okay so time to hook up this pump for the very first time. Uh, all I have to do now is put in the power plug and as you can see the LEDs will go on and the display of the controller will uh, display the date and time. That's also the first thing we're gonna set. First you press the enter key and then you can switch the menu but in this case we press enter again and here you can change the year with the up and down arrows you can switch to the month with the left and right arrows if you need to up and down changes the day or the month as soon as that's set you press the middle key the enter key and then we displaying the time which we still have to set again with the up and down key you can change the hours and with the left and right key you can switch from hours to minutes or seconds. Right now I'm setting the time to the current time here and with the enter key I confirm it and as you can see date and time are set. The next thing we need to do is calibrate the pump. You take some osmosis water and measuring cup and the controller. You press the up arrow, select the pump you want to calibrate with the enter key and then you press the up arrow again to fill the lines with fluid. As soon as those are filled, press the up arrow again, empty your measuring cup because else the measurement won't be right. Place it back. The lines are filled right now. And what we're going to do is press the up arrow again, just like that. And then you wait until in the measuring cup you hit the 100 milliliters. So make sure you have enough osmosis water to at least fill up to 100 milliliters. Now this takes a little while, but as soon as it hits the 100 milliliters, be ready to press the up arrow again. So basically what we're doing right here is uh, teaching the dosing pump when it has dosed 100 milliliters. And by that it will be able to calculate um, your dosing amount. For example, if I want 25 milliliters, it will now know how much to dose. Alright, time for some video editing and let's speed up this uh, filling up because I will be watching here for a few minutes until it hits the 100 milliliters. And now we're nearly there so get ready to press the up arrow. As soon as it hits it, I'm pressing the up arrow right now. There we go. Now just confirm the value by pressing the enter key and then you can exit the menu again by pressing the escape key. And that's it, your pump is calibrated. Remember that you need to do this for each pump and I definitely recommend doing it in the position you're going to be using the pump just to make sure that it works optimal. Alright, then the last thing we're going to do is program the pumps. Press the enter key to hit the menu and go down to set program confirming by enter. Select the pump with enter and then select the amount of times you want it to dose per day. I selected two times, confirm with enter. And then you can select the interval so you can make it dose every other day or every two days. If you put it on zero, it will just dose every day. Confirming, enter again. Alright, and then the first dosing sequence, just select the amount of milliliters you want it to dose with the up and down keys in the left and right. And you also confirm by enter. Then you select in which time you want it to dose. 
in this case I selected 8 it's very easy with left and right and up and down keys again and then automatically you go to the second time you want it to dulse as you can see P1 indicates the pump 1 and it's a number 2 dulsing sequence put it on 25 milliliters again and this time I want it to dose at 12 simply just confirm and enter and that's it you're done you press escape and you're ready to go and your pump will just do as you programmed it alright that's it your dosing pump is ready to go all you need to know is go and get your favorite supplements and hook them up right here I've displayed the reef life system from Aquamedic it's a very nice system to keep all your aquarium values to the one that levels and it works fine with this dosing pump. Now it has multiple capabilities because of course you can also dose uh, for example phytoplankton with this dosing pump to feed your corals. So all in all I think it's a very nice dosing pump especially the external controller is a very nice feature because it will just make installing this pump or adjusting uh, some of your values a lot easier. You won't have to get down on your knees. You can just pick up your controller and set the settings. And of course, it's nice that you can hook up extra fluids if you want by just um, adding the extension model and having eight pumps at your availability. On top of that, it comes with all the needed dosing lines. So with a single purchase, you're just ready to go. All in all, I think it's really worth taking a look at, and I hope in the future you will be enjoying your Reef Dozer Evo 4. Thank you for watching this review and I hope to see you again.